Anyway, hello guys, it's Tubus Bruce here back with another Persona 5 real video. Um, so it seems like our only option right now is to go to sleep. We got us a bit upset. Uh, something I want to talk about. Never mind. We should probably get some rest. Don't worry, it's nothing important. You know, with the amount of times you're like, hey, I want to talk to you about something. Hey, hey, hey. You okay. just got back from your trip and you're already studying? How diligent. I have souvenirs for you. The principal of Shujin Academy has passed away. <laughs> he suddenly stopped while crossing the road and was struck by a large vehicle. Death by external trauma. They say suicide seems to be a strong possibility. Principal Kobayakawa committed suicide? But would someone about to kill themselves try to go to the police station? He even used a taxi to get there. Do you mean this might be another incident? Even if he had a sudden shift in his state of mind, it's still unnatural. I can only suspect that he had a change of heart. A <laughs> change of Are heart. Are you saying he was targeted by the Phantom Thieves? But that's impossible! How are you so certain? Well, in prior cases, the changes of heart seem to be done to make people confess their crimes. It's hard to explain, but this incident seems contradictory to their usual modus operandi. Did Principal Kobayakawa seem any different to you lately? I don't really know. He rarely contacted the students, after all. I see. Could something have happened during the school trip? We didn't go to the school trip. Oh, you're studying. I'm sorry to bother you. Makoto? Hmm? N never mind, it's nothing. Just don't get dragged into trouble, okay? That's so random. Oh, he had a change of heart. He stopped in the middle of the road. Got hit by a truck. <laughs> I better tell the others. It's like, yeah, a change of heart. Stopped in the middle of the road. That must be it. It's not like we haven't had since similar incidents. <sighs> First time at school in a while. I'm so sleepy. You're you have your, your jet lag? Yep. For real? That was quick. Oh yeah, never mind that. Did you know about this? Phantom Thieves are popular now. I was surprised when we got back to Japan. People actually paying attention to who we're gonna target next. Ain't that amazing? I'm getting really psyched. This is where we work hard. Yeah, this is where we work hard. Let's do something big again and surprise the world. Good morning. Good morning, uh, Aminia. Aminia. Oh gosh, dang it. Amamiya uh, senpai and Sakuno Sakamoto senpai, correct? Oh, morning. You're back today too, huh? Yes, it's good to see you both. Um, may I join you two on the way to school? I want to talk a bit about more about the trip, and I want to hear all of your stories from Hawaii. You got it. Should I start with all the heroic stuff me and this dude did for people in Hawaii? You didn't do yes. anything. Um, yes, that sounds great. Sakamoto, stop lying to the freshmen. To the first year. I don't know if they call them freshmen. Uh, in America, we call first years freshmen. Only works when you go up to four years, though. Uh, second years, sophomores, third years, juniors, fourth years, seniors, and then fifth years, you just call fifth years as a real name for them. about you know what right with the principal and we will now begin the emergency morning assembly as many of you may already know principal Kobayakawa passed away yesterday I wonder if that suicide room was for real it happened in front of the police station didn't it I think I was passing through there at the time the principal have been working hard to restore peace ever since the incident with Mr. Kamoshida. He only wished for everyone to be able to lead a normal school life. And because of that love... Love? Bullshit, he was covering something up. Everyone's been talking about it. Maybe it wasn't suicide. Do you think the Phantom Thieves took him down? The Phantom Thieves? Do they kill people? I mean, 
Kamoshida did say he was gonna kill himself to make up for everything he did. That would be amazing. Either way, it serves that principle right. It'd be amazing if they killed Hell people. No, we didn't do jack shit. Are people gonna blame us for this too? I would like to see everyone live up to our late principal's wishes as proud Shujin students. And <sighs> are you gonna ask if I killed him? You know, you already got your answer. I had noticed traces of tampering. Does that mean you truly took the data from my laptop? No matter how I think about it, that would have been impossible unless Makoto was helping you. But she would never do something so foolish. Foolish, really. And is it true that you were completely uninvolved with the Kobayakawa case? We were at the school trip. Busy doing school trip stuff. <laughs> we had nothing against him. What does this mean? <sighs> But I suppose targeting someone at Shujin again and actually taking their life would be nonsensical. Uh, will you believe me now? Probably not. I have no reason to believe everything you've said. Exactly. However, it seems you aren't the type of person who would lie just to protect themselves. I will acknowledge what I must. It's more efficient that way. <laughs> efficient. Anyway. Thank for Yay. All right. In any case, let's move on to the topic at hand. If you saw my investigation data, you would have had the same suspicions I did about Okumura. And if you looked into his palace, you should have seen the answer to those suspicions. Tell me, what did the Phantom Thieves do to Okumura? What did you learn from him? Why did it turn out as it did? I need you to tell me everything. Actually, the Phantom Thieves were happy with how this one turned out. Before we talk about the data we got from Sis, we need to discuss the incident with the principal. People are already talking about it online. Nobody's saying it's because of the Phantom Thieves. So far. People think he did it because that tabloid exposed how he was covering up Kamoshida's abuses. Could it be that we are responsible for Principal Kobayakawa's suicide? What do you mean? If we hadn't changed Kamoshida's heart, maybe this never would have happened. But then Kamoshida would have kept doing what he did if we didn't go and take him down. There's a lot of opinions online. It's only natural that he died, covering up crimes is wrong. The comments I've seen are similar as well. Only the Phantom Thieves are on our side. I wish the Phantom Thieves would take down the police and the politicians of this country. It's, it's not just the news. There's even Phantom Thieves merchandise now. I never expected we'd end up such a big deal. It seems like the public would rather believe in us than in the adults. People are trying to get the Phantom Thieves to solve societal problems, not just personal ones. This is kind of scary. Are we really doing the right thing? I mean, the principal was covering stuff up, right? I guess... He got what was coming to him. That's... <laughs> Whoa, guys, let's get back on topic. Weren't we going to discuss the data we obtained from Nijima? You tell them, Inari. Why me? First, Prosecutor Nijima has been looking into the continued cases of people suddenly collapsing. It seems she is searching for a common thread to tie them all together. Some parts seem to be speculation, but she has cited a beneficiary of the majority of these incidents. The corporation Okumura Foods. More prominently, its CEO, Kunikazu Okumura. Okumura? I feel like I've heard that name somewhere. Big Bang Burger. Big Bang Burger. Big Bang Burger? For real? We just talked about this over the you trip. You know, they only got famous sometime in the past few years. They even had a branch in Hawaii. It says here they benefited both from scandals and the resignations of their competitors' executives. That would seem to be the case. This is too suspicious, though. 
Only one CEO is profiting from these seemingly accidental incidents. I think it's natural to suspect he's intentionally causing them. I get that, but still... We have even more evidence than that. Tell them, Futaba. They already tried putting Okumura's name in the NAF. He has a palace for sure. That settles it then! He's totally our next target! That's right. Okumura is at the top of the rankings after all. Hold on. That doesn't necessarily mean he's evil. If we jump into this too carelessly... Beyond that, this Phantom Thieves fad is... unsettling. Yeah... the excitement levels don't feel normal. We might want to let things calm down a bit first. You too, Han? You're just gonna go against what people want? Huh? No, but... For real? L looks like we're not gonna agree today, then. Sheesh! Some team you are! What's with all the hesitation? I can't stand this! Even you, Ryuji. You just back down the second someone disagrees with you. What? I guess all you've been talking about is using the Phantom Thieves' name to pick up girls anyway. Being hyped up because of the popularity is fine, but getting conceited over it is unacceptable. Hey! Aren't you acting for your own benefit here, too? My appearance might have changed, but I'm still an admirable human. At the very least, I'm more admirable than some carnal blonde monkey! You little- Take your words carefully. Fine. I can take on some small-time target like Okumura on my own. Sorry, uh -huh. but it looks like I'll be getting the credit for solving the mental shutdown mystery. Well, well she was she more was useful more than you, as a matter of fact. 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 Hey, that's inexcusable! I'm going to show you who the useless one actually is! Alright then, bring it on! Ryuji, stop! Looks like I don't belong here after all. Well, this is goodbye. Uh, Morgana, wait! See you. Okay. Thanks for you, Jim. I bet he's back in no time. <sighs> Damn it! I'm human. I have to be. <sighs> All right. I've managed by myself before, and I can do it again now. We just need to take down Okumura before those guys do. That kitty. I can't believe this. The public believes in the justice of the Phantom Thieves. They have no interest in that principle. I'm experiencing equal levels of frustration. My comments on TV turned everyone against me. Then again, I won't allow mere criticism to break my spirit so easily. We won't keep letting ourselves be defeated either. My suspicion after the hacker's case last month is now conviction thanks to the principal's death. The mental shutdown cases and the psychotic breakdowns are surely the Phantom Thieves' doing. I remember the idea. data you showed me about Okumura Foods. Is that the basis for these beliefs? You there think have been we're frequent working occurrences for him? of mental shutdowns surrounding Okumura recently. If only there was a clear connection between him and the Phantom Thieves. Well, it would be problematic if there wasn't one. So, you're jumping the gun here. You really told a man you would terminate his parental authority based purely on your speculation? I'm surprised you would say such a thing to the owner of a cafe you frequent. It's all for the sake of the case. You may have the backing of the SIU's director, but you've been far too aggressive, Sai-san. You're trespassing into police territory. Don't say nobody warned you if this becomes an issue later. My superiors told me the same thing. We first need to know what methods the Phantom Thieves are using. The police can't make a move unless that becomes apparent, after all. This opponent can't be caught by following the rules. What need is there to stick to formalities? So, you wish to ignore protocol in order to reform society. I hope you realize that's no different than what the Phantom Thieves are doing. It's a shame. Especially since we both want to capture the culprit behind the psychotic breakdowns. I really messed up.
messed up. Shall we dispose of it? Leave it be. We do not have time to waste on a solitary feline. Is this really impossible alone? How horrible! What? I, I can't see. Who's there? Hester? Master? What do you mean by that? <laughs> I thought you had no master. You don't call anyone master. Weird. Hey, have you seen Morgana? Uh, should we look for him? I want to, but maybe we're worrying too much. I just kind of expected he'd come home when he got hungry. Oh, maybe he went to someone else's place. Let's ask. He doesn't know where too many people live, though. Morgana's still not back. Um. Huh? He hasn't come home yet? The food's still in his bowl. Do you think he really just took off like that? He's a cat, so it's possible he got into an accident. Does he really seem to be the type who would go off and die on us like that, though? It's been one day. You are worrying too much. He's probably just doing his own stuff. I mean, he used to live alone, remember? Just don't worry about it. I'm sure he'll come back if something happens. Aren't they all being way too cold about this? Oh well. Have a good day. There's no one like the fans. Or Morgana, he feels useless. Must be his rage is coming. Yesterday, my wife threw out one of my books without asking me. The Akumara way, and it was even signed. With his logical management skills, he revived his company that was on the verge of bankruptcy. He then started Big Bang Burger, a bold and creative venture. Remember as a world or it's our philosophy on life itself. How should how could she sell that to a second hand shop? But in times like these, getting one's mind to switch gears is key, wouldn't you agree? A second hand shop is mostly meant for sale of goods and supporting charitable causes, you know but answer? what does a pawn shop offer that a second hand shop doesn't? Isn't it money loans? Yeah. This is it. Very good. Correct. Thrift stores are comparatively less focused on money management, but larger businesses could donate unused stock to them and use them as a tax write-off that way. So it's incredible business acumen to figure out how to be both profitable and charitable at once. Oh, oh yeah, no more Ghana. Knowledge is rank four. Nice. All right. I just remembered, there are rumors that President Okumura may be getting into politics. It is true that the current administration is incompetent in a number of ways. I would love to have a chair a charism charismatic man like him leading the country. Charismatic. Warrior board, I don't like it. Hey, come straight home when school's over, okay? What's wrong? We're gonna wait together in case Morgana comes home. Anyway, come straight home. I wonder what's up with Morgana though. He should just hurry and come back. I'm sure he'll come back when he gets hungry. On to our next story. 
Late last night, multiple glass windows were found shattered at the Okumura Foods corporate headquarters. That seems bad. Hey, this is that Okumura. Other damages have also been reported, including the destruction of a statue depicting Mr. Okumura. Hmm. Wonder if someone's got a grudge against that guy. Wanted info. There were no signs of a break in. Identifying the culprit is expected to be difficult. I think Mona charged in there by himself. Oh, I'm worried. Yeah. Either way, let's go to Grimma's Palace tomorrow. I'll contact everyone. Sorry, Sergio. <laughs> We're having a phone chat without you. We're gonna wait until Kuma's palace. Is that true, Futaba? He did say he'd go alone. Does that mean he's in danger? Chances of that are highly likely. Yeah, we should all go in after him. The palace is most likely at their corporate headquarters. We'll look into it a little more. Alright, let's do it. We gotta look into those mental shutdown things, too. Prefer a little more caution, but this is an emergency. Then we'll go tomorrow. Don't forget, everyone. Oh, I can't leave. Oh, dang it. Worried about Magona. Wait. Oh my god. Ren, you don't have to be that worried about Magona that you can't function. Okay? It's almost at 90%. Gosh dang. I can't st Um Holy crap, this place is huge. It is the headquarters of a large corporation after all. If anything, getting into the real building is impossible. Mona seriously went to a palace based on somewhere like this? Definitely on a different scale than the ones we've dealt with previously. I searched Okumura online. He's totally up to something. Don't you think he's guilty too? Why are you asking me? Oh no, soon enough. I'm positive I'm right. Of course. We're here for you are. I know. I know. No, you don't. We gotta make sure we squeeze the juice on those mental shutdown things out of him too. You mean out of him? You said you found the palace keywords, right, Futaba? The corporate HQ is outer space. Huh? The hell? Oh, so that's why it's called Big Bang Burger. Big Bang is space lingo, you know? Um, not necessarily. So the concept behind the store branch name came from the CEO himself. Outer space, hmm? How exciting. We better be able to breathe once we get in there. Is everyone ready? I'm activating it now. Big Bang is, um... Pretty big. Uh-oh, a catchy soul. Wait, a catchy should have gotten pulled in. You're already considered threats? President Okumura must be on guard, what with everything that's been in the news. It's just causing more trouble for us. Are you calling that? Oh, I'm gonna that. It's as though we're in a film. I wish I brought my sketchbook. You do have a sketchbook. Hey. Mona might be in here somewhere, yeah? Come on, we gotta get looking for him. Yeah, I catch you a hundred percent should have been brought inside with us. So what, I think that's the distance that Owen was when she was brought inside. So, yeah. Now let's do Gordo. Doesn't really matter, but we have out first. What is this? Let's see. Looks like a lever for the elevator to me. And it should be working now. For real? You're amazing, Oracle. <laughs> that was nothing. 
It's certainly reassuring having you with us. Anyway, let's try using the elevator. I should have changed with my personas, whatever. Wait, what pers- What personas do I have? Wait, I can't even change up my personas, I don't think. Yellow doors mean we can go through them. Huh? What's all that noise? Who's that? Robots? There are tons of them. They all have the Big Bang Burger logo. They're saying something. You must adhere to your shifts. If you don't like it, you can quit. However, you will not be compensated. What are they talking about? Oh. They said it's being disposed of. These robots are part of Okumura's cognition, correct? That means they represent... Workers. This is pure speculation, but this is most likely how the workers of Okumura Foods are viewed by their CEO. So he thinks they're his robots? If they're treated like this in reality as well, then the company truly is exploiting them. See? Okumura is a piece of shit, just like I said! Mona is our main objective here. He doesn't seem to be anywhere nearby. Let's search further in. We don't care about a camera today, Ryuji. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, we know you don't care about Morgana. But we do. <sighs> Wonder what Mona's doing in here. We need to find him fast. Yes, Ryuji, we know about your lack of caring for Morgana, but I don't really care. Heck, if it was me, I would say, uh, if you don't care about Morgana, you can leave the team. This appears to be a hologram, but of what? Huh? Hold on what? a second, Joker. Hmm. It shut on us. The door is closed. Is there any way by which we can open it? Forming biometric authentic... What does it mean by that? Authorization error. Only registered personnel may proceed past this point. This security system might be a bit of a problem. What the hell's up with this? Idiot. Look at it. There's no way we can force that thing open. We've hit a blockade quite early. But we have to control the real Okumura's cognition to pass. Oh, that means Mona hasn't been able to proceed any further either. So if he's here in the palace, he would have to be somewhere before this door. Halt, vigilante! Alt vigilante. Who's that? <sighs> Those clothes. <gasps> Could she be? A black mask? Wait, is she the one Madarame and Kanashiro were talking about? So, she's the reason for all those people going brain dead? It was a girl this whole time? What do you mean it was a girl this whole time? <laughs> Are you the one who has been following us? Say something, damn it! <laughs> Enough of your misunderstandings. Mona! You're okay! Long time no see, Panther. Oh, that's the only one year. Uh, hasn't been that long. Acknowledge. You came for the treasure? You should just go home with your tail between your legs. <laughs> really? Actually, we were looking for you. The treasure will be taken by me, and this... This beauty thief! Beauty thief? I'll have you know she's a persona user too. Obviously. My name is Beauty Thief! Oh my goodness. She really called herself that? Uh, any tension that was in the air has just gone out the window. You guys are perfect for each we other. We will take the treasure! Mona already said that. You are not qualified to be phantom thieves! Do sure, you even sure. understand what it means to be a phantom thief? An admirable phantom thief is... Yes. What are yeah, we? Tell them. Yeah. You! What do you think it means? <laughs> Good job. Um... I don't think about it. One who lives is it. One who helps the weak. Yes! That's... Right? 
Yeah. Anything else? Enough with the idle chit chat. Okay. Good job. Started it. Mona, who the hell is she? Wait, I'll fix this. Some very confused person as who she is. You. Me? Learn to take a hint. Okay. Huh? And you, you're very vulgar and very stupid. What? Um. What was it again? Good you job. Came all the way here just to say that. Good job, Magana. Kind of feels like she ain't dangerous at all. Really not. We will take the treasure. You've said that you three times now. Said that. We don't have time to chat. Then stop chatting. <laughs> okay, bye bye. Have fun. No point. It won't open. Don't underestimate us. Oh. Behind you. You were saying? Here they come. Huh? Huh? Oh. Snap out of it. We need to go. It looks like she's never we'll fought shadows. Our usual spot. Let's hurry. Uh, did it look like a little someone was running? Oh, hey. Bet you're tired. Uh, that was quite rough. I haven't felt exhaustion like this since I first awakened to my persona. What have you been looking at all this time? Sorry, I just didn't want to stand around and wait. The burglary at Okumura Foods is circulating the news again. Of course. Oh, Ryuji finally oh, came. Damn it! Why'd they keep coming after only me? Good job. It's all because Little Miss Beauty Thief opened that door. That door most likely had a biometric authentication lock. So how'd she get it to open? I wonder who that girl could be. We were told that she's a Persona user, correct? Do you believe it's true? Well, she did look like one. Did Mona betray us? Yeah. I don't think he's betrayed us. If he had, it'd make more sense for him to directly threaten us, such as exposing our identities. Either way, how the hell's Morgana related to that beauty thief? Considering her tone and physique, she looked about our age. I feel like I've seen her somewhere. Uh, for real? Where at? School. Wait. School, I think? Wait, what? But now that you mention it, I feel like I've seen her too. Is she a student of Shujin? I just feel like that's the case. She did have a mask on, after all. The registry in the student council room has photos of every student. Let's check them all tomorrow. If we can figure out the identity of the beauty thief, that may help us regain contact with Morgana. Futaba and I should further probe into Okumura Foods, then. It'd be best if we investigate how sudden mental shutdowns are connected to them. We're gonna take them down. Her mask... <laughs> Her mask literally doesn't cover anything. I mean, if she had freckles, it would cover those, but that's about it. Uh, things are really starting to heat up online. People are going on and on bashing Okumura Foods. Apparently, they've been secretly using, using low-quality ingredients bought in from overseas. Furthermore, any employees who were suspicious of Okumura were let go without reason. That, coupled with... The mysterious death of a rival company CEO. What's this all of a sudden? Things are going up in flames. I don't really get what kicked it off though. People have been coming after us too. They think we should hurry up and punish them. Uh, don't worry about that. You've had, you've got a heart of steel. It's hard not to worry. Yeah, but we also aren't doing it for fame. It wasn't like this just a few days ago though could there perhaps have been a white well could there perhaps have been a whistleblower from within come on you've got even more reason to take a camera down now you can really accept all this information as truth though either way we need to do something about Morgana. yep anyways see you tomorrow uh, 
How did you defeat them? Oh god, I meet each other. I just want to decorate my room. What else? Someone normally call themselves beauty thief? That Morgana made her say it. Uh, still a weird thing to say, even if he told her to. Plus, they lied about her being able to use Persona 2. What do you mean they lied? <laughs> what? We don't know if that is indeed a lie, though. But we didn't see her use one. None of us used one, though. No matter how you slice it, she's totally j just an amateur. Uh, don't let you burn out. I don't think we gotta worry about that, dude. Can't take her lightly. She has more gun on her side, remember? Agree with Futaba. At the very least, they're all one step ahead of us. True. Amateur would not have been able to open that gate. They've clearly figured out something we don't know. We need to uncover the identity of that master goal. Cool. This girl's hot! Oh my goodness. Oh, but she's younger than me. Ryuji! It's okay no with way. older. She's the same age as me? She looks like my dad's friend. What? Get back to work. Said you. Why don't we take a break? It's no surprise our concentration is waning. Even if it's only the female students, there are easily hundreds of them. They're all starting to look the same to me. Think we can really find her? Uh, I'm sure. Someone sure is confident. When it might not. Hmm? This girl! Haru Okumura. <gasps> Okumura? Wasn't the beauty thief like this too? Especially the fluffy hair. That's gotta be her. It would also explain how she got past the door's biometric reader. This may be worth looking into. But why was she at the palace? We could just make her spill the beans herself. She may have already gone home for the day, so let's try tomorrow. I'm gonna lock up. I'll see you all tomorrow. This goal is Haru Kumar. Come on, move. Do you want help? That looks heavy. Um, would you happen to be interested in gardening? Yeah, I want some help. Really? In that case, if you could help me unload this. Sure. Boys sure are strong. Thank you. You're a second year, aren't you? That makes me just a tad older. Um, have we met somewhere before? Oh, I haven't introduced myself yet. I'm... Haru Okumura, correct? Thank the only you, daughter of Kunikazu Okumura, CEO of Okumura Foods. Care to explain why you are inside your father's palace? Oh, so that's where we met. Wow, you figured it out in just a day. You looked really good in that biker gang outfit. Let's not talk about that. So why did you become a phantom thief? <sighs> My father's highly regarded as a manager, but I had various doubts about him. Things have grown quite serious lately. That's why I want to make amends, even though it may only be for my own satisfaction. But I wonder if this is just running from the problem. Maybe. Where did you meet Morgana? It was pure coincidence. I found a lonely-looking cat in front of our office building. And that was Morgana? Mm-hmm. And when I followed him, I ended up in the metaverse. There's no way for me to change my father's company. But if I became a phantom thief, 
I thought I'd at least be able to change him. Isn't there any way we can work together? I can't literally... cooperate with people who don't know what they want to do. What? what you're doing is unnecessarily causing a stir among the public. Besides, the phantom thieves who should be helping the weak are not helping their own teammate. <sighs> I just want my father to atone for his crimes and help Monachan, who gave me a chance to do just that. But aren't our objectives the same? It'd be better if we work. No, thank you. I will do this with Monochan and him alone. For that. Great so far. She hit quite a sore spot. We don't know what we want to do, huh? It seems getting her cooperation won't be possible. Let's consult with the others on our next move. We shouldn't ignore Morgana either. Morgana. Morgana currently does not want to talk to us. Thanks, by the way, Ryuji. I'm home, father. Drive them away. That's right. Make it a priority. Uh, I finally get a foothold into politics and this happens. Phantom thieves? Huh. Did the media ask you anything? No, not at all. Um, what's this about phantom thieves? It seems I'm ranked first on the forum of these so-called phantom thieves. Is it because of the news coverage? It's jealousy of the successful. Nothing but the barks of the masses who lack the resolve to sacrifice what's needed for their well-being. Both the young and the old are overjoyed with some foolish idols. This country has no future. Oh, really? You're part of the country? What if they do exist? What if these phantom thieves really can steal hearts? Are you still having doubts about me? Of course. No. More importantly, I hope things are going well with that young man. Yes, father. Very well, then. He may not seem like it, but he's still the son of an influential politician. Be cordial with him. He'll eventually become a necessary connection for this company. Or rather, for me. I understand. I will do the best I can. Good. That's I should be married off. Okumura should be. Oh, of course. Daughters of Akuma should just benefit you. I'm guessing son should be the same way, right? If saviors won't betray us. Okay. Hey, I found some more comments on Mishima Kun's website. Weird. Uh, they were thanking us for resolving quests that we didn't actually complete. Oh, it's Morgana. And Haru. Of course it is. It's probably just prank. Or, you know, it's the other. But those requests are indeed resolved. Someone must be going into mementos other than us. Can I just work out my job? Okay, I think it's Morgana. Yes, of course it's Morgana. Great, he's probably taking the beauty thief with him too. Great training for her. We should look into this. I was thinking of persuading Akuma-san at school, but she's been avoiding me. She's very easy to find. Just stake out the flowers because she waters them. How are, we, how are we gonna look into this then? We'll stake out mementos. Obviously. Um, good plan. Rather chase them down instead of sit won't Ryuji? You're the reason we're in this mess. The method is indeed a classic one, but it is a safe bet. Yeah, I think it's better than just looking for them randomly. I'm gonna have all sorts of snacks. No teachers to stop me on this field trip. Well, why don't we get this over with? Let's do it tomorrow. Yeah, I sometimes hate how many of this, um, how many of these long drawn out story things you have to do because it stops you from doing other stuff like I can't up confidence and stuff while this is going on or up stats or anything I'm stuck until we get more got back which kind of sucks kind of I mean I appreciate it when I'm not in a rush to do things but when I'm in a rush to do things it's I can't believe annoying it. Hi, everyone.
everyone! How's everyone doing? We're now from your trip? Come on, you're young. Hawaii doesn't even count as going to a foreign country. Yeah, it does. What? <laughs> it doesn't count as going to a foreign country. It's full of Japanese tourists. Bet you were able to speak Japanese wherever you went, weren't you? Uh, no. Probably not. Probably a few places you can speak Japanese, but... They have America. They have tourists from all over the world, I think, Hawaii. Plus, US citizens live there. And some foreigners live there. Shopkeepers would use Japanese to pressure you into buying things. they as if their life depended on it. I'm used to it though, so I actually haggle with them in English. Uh, show me how much you know your English. Can it be an easy thing? What's one of the supposed origins for the phrase "cat got your tongue"? Wild cats you don't meow. Cats eating human tongues. Breed cats with no tongues. Wild cats? No, cats eating human tongues. That's just weird. It. Makes the most Good. sense though. Good. Yes. Um. In ancient Egypt, it's said that the tongues of liars and blasphemers were cut out and fed to cats. Okay, that makes more sense. For those that don't know, Egypt worshipped cats quite a lot to the point where, um, I don't know if it was this country, um, but yeah, a lot of civilizations in ancient times and mythologies worshipped cats, and Egyptian mythology is kind of one of them that puts a high emphasis on cats um, and ancient Egypt civilization in general placed a high emphasis on cats to the point where when humans died they buried the cats with the humans which that's still somewhat done by some people if you like your pets enough but I don't think a lot of people bury themselves with their pets anymore actually I don't even know some people may not even bury their pets I don't know Uh, it's also possible it came from the pirates, Keto Nine Tails, leaving a prisoner too strong to talk. There are actually a lot of other expressions involving cats. It's because people loved cats. Hello? <laughs> Don't know what that was about. A cat has nine lives, for instance. That relates to how cats seem capable of surviving all kinds of dangers, even ones you'd expect to kill them. Cats always land on their feet this is a well-known phrase. Uh, man, it's crazy how many people want us to change the heart of the Akuma CEO. I mean, duh, he was doing tons of Sadie crap. Sounds like everyone's expecting us to actually take him down. Come on, we gotta do this. Uh, I'm game. Heck yeah! That aside, does everyone remember the plan for today? Yes, we're to hold a stakeout in Mimitos. You think they're gonna show? We'll just have to wait until they do. For real? We can't go back until we make up with Rana. I'm sure they'll come. I hope you're right. You said you didn't want to sit around and wait, now you say you hope you are all right. Or rights? Yuji doesn't actually care too much. You're going to apologize when Mona comes, alright? I know already. And why are you just saying that to me? We need to be wary of the beauty thief, too. So we're doing a stakeout here. We'd better be ready for the long haul. Ain't he gonna show up today? I mean, what time is it now? Hold that thought. You guys are seriously slacking off way too much. We can't go anywhere without our car. With us? Aren't you fulfilling the requests on the Phantom Aficionado website? Even leaving comments? It'd be best if you don't accept them so recklessly. The police will track you down in no time. If that were oh. to happen, we'd be caught up in it as well. I was leaving comments. That's not what I intended. But that would be my fault. Uh, I'm actually not that great with machines. I'm truly sorry. Why are you apologizing? They're telling us for our sake. We should be thanking them. Won't you please put what happened behind us? So I'm the one you're here for? Of course. You guys need me after all? Is that it? Uh, you're vital to our team. Really? I guess. Ryuji! Wait, what do you say? I'm sorry too, Morgana. 
We weren't taking your feelings into cons oh. consideration at all. Lady on. Uh, everyone, shouldn't you be using code names? Ryuji didn't really mean what he said, you know? He wants to apologize. Well, it's like... It was my bad, too. I mean, I don't mind if you're not human or if you're useless. What a douche. Doc. On setup was completely ruined. Oh, is that right? So I am just some useless cat to you guys. You're so full of yourselves, but do you have the skills to back that up? And now you guys are running away. Try and catch me then. Get in, beauty thief. Good job, Ryuji. Look what you did. Now they're running away. Do this. Don't count on me ever coming back. There they go. Did he even think about how long he made us wait? Fine, we'll do this. Jeez, this isn't what we came here to do. Well, we can blame Ryuji for everything that's going on. All right. Look, there he is. Uh, we need to go out to him and talk things through. Ooh, my cords are real tangled. <laughs> Piece of mm, I won't let myself get caught by someone like you. Uh, we are facing a cat here. Does it not seem somewhat reckless to chase him on I'm foot? Okay. You should give up easily. There are dead ends all over this floor. We can do this if we manage to corner him in one. But there's also a way down to the lower floors, right? Oh, he's already cornered. That's great. That didn't take very long. <laughs> You're trapped now. <laughs> How naive. You really think you've captured me? Rude. Crap, look out. Sheesh. What would he have done if he ran us over? Hey. Stop complaining and let's get after him again. Well, hopefully- well, is it hard driving? Oh my god, I can hit the gas, but someone needs to steer, I think. Okay. Wonderful, we have reached him. But will you listen? Shut up, I've got nothing to talk about with you guys. <laughs> Not again. There will be no end at this rate. Huh? What was that? Came from over there. Let's go take a look. Good job. How'd you even... <laughs> that idiot crashed. Hey! Yep. Anna, are you okay? How'd you even do that? There's no walls. You gotta hear us out, Morgana. There's nothing I have to talk to you about. Come on. There's no need to keep being so stubborn. Seriously. I can't just give in like this. I have my pride to protect. Pride. <gasps> What's that over there? Huh? You guys fell for that? Good job. Shoot. It seems we've fallen for the oldest trick in the book. Uh, those two. Perfect we'll never for end each at other. This rate. What do we do now? I don't hear the sound of his engine at all. Could they have left Mementos? Maybe. Her lack of vehicle puts us at a severe disadvantage. We should probably just head home for today. Damn it! Freaking Morgana! them right are you sure that was what you wanted of course it was just being petty you made me look everywhere for you what were you doing somewhere without any reception out late with guys that's it isn't it i would never do such a thing come on let me have some fun too will ya can't you do that for me? Uh! Haru! You little... Let go of Haru! Ah! Uh, what the... Goddamn cat! Yeah! Mama-chan! Damn it. I am useless. Someone... Anyone... Is anybody out there? Will you shut up, you stupid cat? Damn that Morgana! He is so getting it the next time we run into him. Um, buddy. 
just ran into him. Was that Mona's voice? Hey, over there! That doesn't seem right to me. Sorry about the disturbance. It's just a lover's quarrel with my fiance. Fiance? What? But she's clearly fighting you. How dare you make a fool of me? I'll be telling your father about this too. I won't forget your faces. Are you okay? I'm fine, but Mona-chan... This is nothing. Was that person really your fiance? Whoa, so you're engaged then? That didn't seem like an ordinary fight though. Shouldn't you talk to your parents about it? I think it'd be useless. I'll just be told to beg for his forgiveness. Even if it means groveling on the ground. <laughs> All right. It seems she has her reasons. I'll, um, apologize about what happened earlier. So, would you let Haru rest for a while? Of course. We'll take her to your place, yeah? Or Thanks. Guys, we'll take everyone. Did you get enough rest? Mona-chan? Anyway, it's just as I told you a moment ago. I can't have you guys risk your lives anymore for someone useless like me. To be frank, there's no assurance that I'll turn back into a human either. This can't be called a fair deal. That's why I think we should split up. <laughs> Who said we're acting as phantom thieves for your sake? I'm doing it to expand my own horizons. No need to tiptoe around the situation. We're splitting up. You should stop lying. Do you remember what you said to me when I found you collapsed in the metaverse? That you're a phantom thief. That you're going to get stronger and have the others acknowledge you. You love being here. Don't you? Of course not! I was lying to myself too. But when I formed a contract with my persona, I understood it all. Doing this because my father is doing something horrible was nothing but a superficial reason. The truth is, I... Don't want to get married, right? I thought that since an adult with responsibilities made the decision, it couldn't be wrong. I was such a fool. Tied down by vague notions and stayed quiet as my marriage partner was chosen. But I won't tolerate this anymore. I can't stand that creep! <sighs> That's how I truly feel. Why are you looking at me all of a sudden? Mona-chan, why is it that you always talked about becoming human again? That's... At first, I only thought of this team as a temporary dwelling until I regained my memories. But I wasn't making any progress on finding out what I am or why I was born. Morgana... I wanted a reason of my own. A reason to stay with the Phantom Thieves. I don't have anyone I want to save or get revenge on. Someone like me has no reason to stay here. That's why... To me, this team is... Come on, say it! You can do it! It's the only place I can belong! I want to stay here forever! That was refreshingly honest. <laughs> you should have just said so from the start, jeez. If you stick with me, there's no telling what kind of trouble will come up. 
You better be sure about this. It's a little late for all that, don't you think? Of course we want to stay with you, too. <clears throat> uh, so... Well... I'm sorry I worried you guys. This is where I belong. My mind's all set. I'll make sure to work hard to pay my dues. It's too late to cancel our deal, got it? <laughs> I expect great things. I'd better make up for the time we wasted dallying around. Okay, rank eight or that yeah, rank eight. All right. Well, in the end, wouldn't you say that your encounter with us was destiny? That's right. Encounter. Hmm? Oh crap, the last train's coming up! I... I must go as well. Let's continue this another time. I... Stay at our place. I'll arrange it. See you all tomorrow! I'm gonna sleep. I'm exhausted. Almost like nothing happened. Man. This place is as drab as always. Rude. Anyway, I think this is a good place to leave off this video. Let's do it. Because I've enjoyed. Like, video, comment, and subscribe for more. It's the next video. Whenever, whatever, though. Maybe. Bye, guys.